Okay, Charles of Law here, and we're in front of the legislator on almost a full moon on a Saturday evening. And this is, I would say, I know I got it mixed up so many, about 54 days before the next provincial election here in New Brunswick. 54 days left. Now, there's a lot of issues and I'm trying to cover, trying to change uh, the style and trying to figure out what am I gonna talk about. My God, I just seen two, I just seen two cops there, RCMP. We're just talking away. My God, we're talking about uh, guns and everything. I told them, which I, I made this public anyway. I said, I'm one of those ones that shouldn't have a gun because I'm one of those idiots that if I had a gun, I be, might be tempted to use it, or I could use it on me. And that's why uh, they, certain individual in Canada shouldn't have a gun. And I'm proud to say, really? Uh, I'm not interested in having guns. But anyway, never mind that. Charlie, stay focused. There's one, never mind the guns. There's something more violent than guns that's going on in New Brunswick. And the two main political party do not touch they don't want to touch it. They've been there for over a hundred years and they don't want to talk about it. And it's a very emotional, and you know what? It's worse than shooting people. What is that thing called? It's called the infamous Irving Blacklist. Irving Blacklist. Once you're on the Irving Blacklist, you are done. You're done, done, kaput, tufini. What is a nerving blacklist? They make sure that they put you on because Irving is a big empire, huge empire. It's so huge, they would even cut you off from writing letters to the newspaper. Me, I used to have two, three letters to the editor a week until the Irvings got involved and said, enough is enough. God, letters to the editor. Can you imagine? Waste my time on letters to the editor. So, what happened? Irving Blacklist. Former refinery workers were in the Irving, are, are on the Irving Blacklist. I made the Irving Blacklist, and I know there's one because uh, I was told, I won't mention my source. My source, let me just give you a hint. My source is very, very, very high. So, it turned around, I had my problem with golf operators. Golf operators is a very, very racist and non-union company. They, I mean, it's so bad that I would last, focus Charles, focus. Golf operators, when you have a supervisor that says, hey, how come the states got the niggers? and Canada got the frogs. Oh, they had first choice. I'm not sure, but I believe that's racism. And I made a complaint, they kept the supervisor, and that's where my trouble started. Thought they wanted, I, it, it was terrible. I'll, I might do a video on that one of these days. But the Irving Blacklist, they make sure they have, okay, sorry, I'm jumping. Must be the moon, must be the moon. Turn around. After the shipyard, and I worked for Gulf operators for about a year, I have decided to apply for a job, staging company. Then I found out 80% of their work were contracts with the Irvings. Tried a job, tried for a job in Charlotte, Charlotte County, Connors, or Copes, because I met a girl in Charlotte, Charlotte County. Guess what? Again, Irving Blacklist. Couldn't get a job, no. So what do they do? They put you on the, on the list. Either you're forced to leave this province if you want to put food on the table for your loved ones, or you commit suicide. This Irving Blacklist is very, very inhuman, very, very dangerous, and causing a lot of emotion. Now, the government, the two main political parties, they should hold an inquiry on 
this Irving Blightless. But no, it's Mr. Irving. So, this Ir have you been, have you, do you know about the Irving Blightless? Leave some comments. So, this is what, under almost a full moon, this is the issue. And next election, don't vote for the PC, don't vote for the Liberals. Vote for the Green Party, vote for the People Alliance, and maybe if there's a few members in there, they could bring the issue up of this infamous Irving Blacklist to the House, to the legislature, and maybe that those poor people that's on the list will once again be able to find work. <laughs>